This is Kevin King with Pinehurst Websites and today I'm going to do a series on starting a new store on Shopify for 2019. This is step one, signing up for Shopify. So if you don't already have an account, uh, you can either go to Pinehurst Websites and you can get a two week free trial. Just go to the banner on the homepage and say start your free trial and it'll take you to Shopify or you can go to uh, the description in this video and there'll be a link to a free trial with Shopify so you can click on that link and either either one of these will take you to Shopify's homepage so all you need to do is enter your um, enter your email address and click on get started and then you can create a password for your store make something secure uh, write it down of course or put it use a password program uh, but you want it to be very secure because uh, your store is going to be linked to checking account information and things like that so that you can make deposits from your website to your checking account. So uh, what we want to do is just go ahead and enter a password. And then uh, create a name for your store. Now I'm going to use uh, Jewelry 2019. This doesn't have to be what the name of your store is. You're going to buy a custom domain at some point. You can do that directly through Shopify or you can go to GoDaddy, buy a custom domain, and it's very simple uh, to connect it. So I'm just going to use that custom domain and go ahead and create the store right now. So it'll take a second and then it'll create your store. Uh, you can skip this right here. This uh, page is going to be used to populate information within your admin, so you want to put accurate information, uh, maybe the address that would be associated with your bank account, uh, since this will um, be linked. Also, it will be used for shipping as well uh, to create your shipping rates. Uh, initially in Shopify so you want to make sure that you use wherever maybe you will be shipping from where your business address is. So this will take you to the admin of Shopify and this is where you'll create your store or your website and uh, you are going to be on a trial plan but at any time you can select a plan and go on to a go on to a live plan. So um, that's all there is for step one. Uh, if you want to visit the site and see what the site is like, it's going to be password protected, but uh, this site will be available and it's going to have a default template uh, and you'll just need to fill out that information and that's what we're going to get to in step two.